Hello, welcome to Shadows of Judgment. We're gonna see who comes up next. We just did the waters. Yay. Who will be up next for our uh, grand endeavors of seeing what's going on for this lovely week? Shall we? We shall. Air! We got King of Swords. Y'all might be in a pissy mood. Alright, air signs, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Please check your charts. This resonates with you a good deal. If not, don't worry about it. It's just a card game. Just boop your nose and away it goes, right? Also, figure out where you are because I literally have no idea where you are. I just guess. So. And cross watch your switch where you need to. Gemini, you're up first. You're trying to recover your broken heart or you're trying to heal yourself in some way. It just feels like it's taking forever and it's like, what the fuck, man? I'm so bored with this shit, you know? Oh, and someone might be coming to give you an eighth pentacle. Page of pentacles. Could be an earth sign. Taurus, Virgo, Cap, right? You don't feel very much like a victor on this side. On this side, it feels like all this waiting for potential is not working out for you. And you feel like you need this person to bring balance of some sort. Or they can bring balance, right? Because, you know, you have a lot of temptations in your face this week, Gemini. And a lot of that shit, I don't think you're going to be able to get away with. Like, whatever you're thinking... Whatever you're planning on wanting to do, don't do it. Don't do it. I just feel like there's temptation here in you possibly succumbing to the lion letting it chew your face off and all that shit, right? That potential is there. So you have to be really careful, you know? And there is a third party, but it would lead to a breakup in this. Like, it, I feel like there's somebody who you're tempted with who you think can bring balance to you like not really even in a sexual way or anything like that but it's like they have this potential um possibly a potential for you to corrupt and that's always fun you know it's a new person or some shit like that or maybe it's somebody you haven't been around in a really long time and now you're like ooh, now i get to really fuck with them right could be one of those things but in a way it's going like looking for a balance in this person might cause you to separate from them so you have to be really careful, because I feel like you might actually be leaning on somebody. Yeah, yeah, definitely could be Cap. God damn it, I've been everywhere. Well, not me particularly, but still. Let's see. And choices, mental choices. It's like you want to fess up to something. Even though you know it won't work. And that's something to do with it over here, Gemini. And the, and there's like this um, not so good connection right here. I almost feel like someone's getting bumped or something. Alright, someone isn't willing to take a leap of faith to move to calmer waters or to move to better places, right? However, they are open with their affections and their lovings. They're just, it got a lot of insecurities, though. Enough to where, like, you know, I feel like they don't have anything to offer. I mean, if they did offer something, Gemini, or you were to offer something this week, Gemini, it'd just make up the five of pentacles, and people would be feeling left out in the cold, wanting to come back in, since both of those are reverse. You know? It's like the insecurities make the offer bad. Oh, excuse me, I've been up since four. I had to work this morning. Anyway, Gemini, that's your week so far. Be very careful, dudes. Like, don't get, don't be connecting to people just because they seem like, you know, they might give you something that you're looking for, mentally or otherwise, you know? Libra, it's your turn. Boop. You don't have love, or the cup's overturned, or someone spilled it in someone's face, someone poured it in someone's lap, someone was just mad through the fucking cup, either way. Uh, that cup's not there, someone's in a fighting mood, they're ready for words, it's just like, I don't want to show you love, I want to show you the side of my stick, 
You disrespectful mo you know. Ew. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio could be dealing with water sign. Someone isn't seeing the love even though they got the cup of their own. And now on the inside of that cup, they feel like it's the, they got to throw some hands. They got to defend themselves. I feel like someone did this shit to themselves with this Ace of Cups, Libra. You or someone else you're dealing with. But someone feels like they've been betrayed because there is no cup. Or they hurt themselves because of it. Okay, someone's combative, but they're trying to be loving or open with their emotions. And that's like... Like someone's trying to fight for this queen or something? Because it looks like she's got an open door. It's like it's right there. It's just like, I know you want this. Someone's fighting to get in that door. And this situation was from back in the day where you felt like the love wasn't there and all you did was hurt yourself. And now, like, someone over here is just sitting there waiting, just be like, ah. I wish they would just text me. You know, it's just like, I wish they would text me. I wish they would text me right now. You know, that hopeless or romantic kind of thing. Um, hmm. I think this queen's interested in the door and she wants to get some more information, especially about a past situation right here. Right? Someone's wanting to know something. Whether or not a knight of pentacles is going to offer something could be an earth sign. Slow moving offer. Oh, wowza! Well, or, or whether or not, like, it's fucking Capricorn. Caps, get the fuck out of everyone's stuff, man. Get, you know? Um, potentially bad relationship connection here. And then there's something that's slowly but surely making its way in your direction, possibly, Libra. Because, like, literally, this is the only card that's been representative of you at all. Uh, I don't even think the Ten of Swords represents you. That's just you. So I don't know. It's like there's an open door. You're pretty worried about this night riding up. Mm. What is up with this? Third party situation that led to a breakup or addictions, vices, things people didn't want to let go of. That shit had to end in order to bring some balance, right? Because we all need a little bit of balance. However... Uh, you possibly are not trying to go into a battle or a fight for some reason. You're not trying to express anything. You know. Uh, possibly because you might be being a control freak. Just throwing, just throwing hands, man. Just throwing hands. And that's causing you not to... Um, that might cause you or someone else not to want to take leave of faith, Libra. This doesn't have to be you, but it's like it's your week. But it's like... It's like not wanting to say anything because that's the best way of you feeling like you're still in control. But it's like, it's not a good kind of control. It's like a... It's almost like a desperation to hold on to something that doesn't belong. And I'm not sure if that's you, Libra. Or if that's someone you're dealing with, but someone's... Keeping their mouth shut for the sake of control. Running away almost, if you will. Not trying to take a leap of faith even though they recognize that the balance needs to be had. But, that's the week I got for you, Libra, so be very decisive, you know. I mean, if you're going to keep your mouth shut, you, you do what's best for you. But sometimes some things need to be said. You know, just saying. Aquarius! your turn let's see what's going on with y'all let's see we got secrets someone's got some secrets the moon pisces or cancer right and no manners whatsoever page of pentacles might be an idiot could be an earth sign. You know, 
And there's happiness right there. Leo's car. Mm. Someone might be offering bullshit to your happiness. These secrets are holding back a tower. Right? And this person who's offering sh bullshit is, you know, trying not to let anything die. There is Scorpio's card. You guys got like four fucking ma major arcana so far. What is up? You know? It's happiness. You're trying to work on it. You're trying to get it. You're trying to get on your horse all naked and shit and just ride away. Oh, that could be you, Aquarius. You're deciding to cut something out. In regards to these secrets and how this tower is held up. Um, whereas this person over here is kind of crying their eyes out because they still don't want anything to die. No. While you're trying to recover your broken heart. Mm. You are riding in the are you or nothing. And this person, all they can do is offer you their cup, if you will. Hmm. I don't know about this guy. I don't know. I, I don't like the like of all all. I have been pulling nothing but earth out this deck as a way and like. All of a sudden, here's Paige being stupid and shit. Just just the one. Anyway, let's see. Um, someone had to walk away. It's a better and happier things. They just don't know where they're going. They have no idea what direction to take. But they'll hold on to their strength until they figure it out, Aquarius. It's just going to take a lot of rebellion and a little bit of not listening to any sort of authority figure. You know, in order to actually get the offer you think you deserve this week. Hmm, look at that, Aquarius. Yours was interesting. Indeed. I'm not sure how it works, but hopefully it works very well for you. Anyway, air signs. That's your shadow this week. So if you enjoyed this, please like, share, subscribe. Um, no pressure, of course. That's up to you, but whatever. Anyway, love your all's faces. You have a good one. Bye-bye.